I finally have my own signature shoe. And so um, that, that's what's in this box today. Growing up, I pretty much only had one pair of shoes at a time. But ever since I went to the NBA, since then, my, my love for sneakers and, and my collection has definitely grown. So a year and a half ago, I was a shoe free agent. And at that time, I knew I wanted to do something different. I, at that time, I, had, I hadn't even heard of the company Xtep. And after taking a meeting and doing a little bit of research, uh, found out that Xtep is the number one running shoe company in China. And they also are really big into fashion but they wanted to move into basketball and they had never done basketball before. And for me, that was really, really intriguing to be able to create something brand new. And so um, um, I signed with Xstep and I've been with them ever since. And you know, the, the signature shoe process takes 18 months typically, but uh, we were able to drop my first signature shoe after 12 months of me signing and so we cut short the process by half a year and this is what i have in front of me today this is the jalen one uh, after 11 years of professional basketball i finally have my own signature shoe and so um, that that's what's in this box today and and uh this is the main colorway you know for me i, I love the color blue and so um, these are the the water shoes that represent walking on water you know, we have the logo, but there's water elements everywhere. Um, and if you look at the bottom too, it's, it's like the ripples or the water. Um, and, and uh, you know, one unique thing that they did is on, on the back of this one, they have the logo, but on the other one, they have this number one, which represents the Jalen ones. But if you look carefully, there's a line down the middle and it's actually two ones, which also rep represents the 11th year of professional basketball that I finally got a signature shoe. Uh, this number right here kind of represents three things. It's the Jalen ones, it's my basketball number, and it's also my 11th year of professional basketball. And, and you see the ones in different places and, and you see the different elements of water um, all through the shoe. With my first signature shoe, the main story I wanted to tell uh, is, is our slogan, which is nothing stops me. And that story came about with just uh, me going through a lot of different things. And at one point, I, it just really looked like I was never gonna have my own signature shoe. Waiting 11 years, uh, I might be the, the oldest player to ever have their first signature shoe. Um, and I am the first Asian American to have my own signature uh, basketball shoe. And so I guess the nothing stops me mentality is about the persistence and the perseverance. Maybe you have to wait longer than expected. Maybe you have to work a little bit harder or maybe at times it doesn't look like it's gonna happen. But if you stick with it, it can and, it, and you have to embody this nothing stops me mentality. Um, and then the, the water, why we chose this, this colorway and what we tried to display through the shoe is this concept of walking on water, which goes back to the passage uh, in the Bible of Peter walking on water. And this has been really influential in my logo. People think my logo is a JL7, but it's also two feet walking on water and the bottom of the seven is a water drop. And so uh, this passage was really, really big for me, my rookie year with Golden State when I couldn't even get off the bench. I was in the, at that time, the D League and um, I just was really, really struggling and that passage came to me and the, the point of the passage is when you focus on God, um, you can do supernatural things like walking on water. That passage stuck with me and then the next year was Linsanity. And that was a great example to me of, hey, when, when you're focused on God, he can do anything. He can do miracles. Miracles as big as insanity. Four. Win for the win. Got it. This, uh, this pair is uh, the Ali's, Muhammad Ali. And I love this because of everything that Ali stood for, obviously. And, and if you look on the inside, it has float and it has sting. Uh, one on each shoe and it's float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. And you can see this is kind of the butterfly element. And so even on the side, we see the butterfly wings and then there's also the bee and the beehive. Muhammad Ali represents so much transcending sports, uh, excellence, greatness, confidence. And, and I also love just a two-tone 
colorway uh, that we're able to choose with the one being primarily yellow and one being primarily black. And this is all, this is a very unique pair and you know, might be my favorite colorway. The last pair I wanted to highlight today uh, is, a, is a classic uh, primarily black, all black shoe. And uh, on the inside of the tongue, it says history made, but these are the champions. Um, and I was the first Asian American to ever win an NBA championship. And so we wanted to have a shoe to really commemorate that, but it's not, to me, this, this shoe isn't just, oh, you, you know, you win a championship and that's what it's about. It's really a champion, uh, a champion's heart and a champion's mindset. But what does it mean to have a champion's heart and a champion's mindset is that you're always striving to be the best and you don't settle. And one of the shoes, one of the stories that this shoe tells is that your greatest opponent is yourself. And as you go through life, seasons will come and go and challenges will come and go, but you always have to face yourself every single day and that you wanna adopt the champion's mindset to continue to strive to be the best person or the best player or the best whatever that you wanna be. Really to me, this shoe or in this shoe line is about embodying a spirit of, you know, a spirit or a mentality that you wanna have. And so when people tie these shoes on, I want them to really feel something, um, whether it's the perseverance or the, the endless chase of your dreams or whether it's, you know.